and with as as little supplies as possible, DIY this thing at the most cost-effective way and uh, the quickest way and get some data and see uh, what that's going to show. And uh, I believe it's going to show some, some good data as far as getting that board three. Some of those chips that are in this higher area here, uh, chip 54 and on up, uh, uh, out of that 89 to 90 rays, especially with some nice duct right now, we're running the 10-inch duct on the KS5s. And we saw the same issue when we were running the six inch duct. Of course, Green Miner recommends that y'all, if you're going to use duct, at least uh, nothing smaller than eight inch duct and make sure that it's as straight as possible while you're running it. Um, so we've already connected the power up to the PSU here where we've uh, removed the sleeve a little bit and got it compressed down onto the board with keeping the sleeve in any of these areas here. And we've got these areas marked out here where when we're three finger away for the mount.